so hi everyone in this tutorial we will learn how we can generate unlimited audio cloned samples and that too of any length you can generate audio samples of 3 minutes 4 minutes as well or even longer also using f5 tts in your local system using python so let's get started so before we jump on to how to set it up and all i will first show you a demonstration of my audio cloned mp3s that i have generated so this is a small text that I have given it. This is data science in your pocket. We have about 1000 tutorials on data science in a check out our medium and gumroad page. Now see this. This is a 7 second audio that it has inferred. This is data science in your pocket. We have about 1000 tutorials on data science AI. Check out our medium and gumroad page. So as you can see the audio was very clear and I think it is very difficult for anyone to make out whether it was me actually speaking or the audio. Now even longer audios can also be generated. Here I have given an entire product description about one of my products. Generative AI interview question PDF that I have hosted on Gumroad. So let's see how it goes. Let's run this one. This is interview questions commonly asked by ACO generative AI interview with this special PDF featuring 60 sus interview questions commonly asked by top MNCs and innovative startups. This comprehensive guide covers core topics in generative AI, including basics, large language models, LMS, fine tuning techniques, the retrieval, augmented generation, RAG framework, AI agents, handling LM hallucinations, prompt engineering, evaluation metrics, can and miscellaneous topics. Whether you are a beginner or an experienced professional, this resource is designed to enhance your confidence and knowledge, ensuring you're well prepared to excel any Jinai interview. So it, it can even generate this long audios as well and even longer audios as well. So once you have seen the tutorial, let's see how to set this up. So first of all, you need to go to this particular Git repo that is F5 TTS as you can see. It is one of the best open source audio cloning model that has been released and they have given some clear instructions how to get started. So first of all, you need to create a virtual environment for F5 TTS where you would be pip installing a few packages. Torch 3.2.0, Torch Audio, and from this particular URL, as you can see, do remember this because Torch is getting updated very frequently. Once you are done with this, you must get a folder like this. If you see F5 TTS, and here would be the different files that are coming up. You need to git clone the repo as well, and then create the environment. Once done, uh, you are once you are ready with this all the files are visible as you can see like this you need to write this particular python script so this is very easy to write we would be running this particular command import sub process and then write a function command f5 hyphen tts underscore infer hyphen cli model is e2 hyphen tts you can go with f5 hyphen tts as well these are two different models but i have figured out that e2 is better this is the important part. You need to provide a reference audio sample.mp3 and the reference text spoken in that audio. So if you are not, uh, uh, if you don't provide this, I think the results might not be that great. So here is a sample of my audio sample.mp3 and this is a reference text that I have given. So hi everyone. Today we will be testing out flux GIF generator. Basically what I spoke in the mp3 and then you need to pass a parameter text, whatever text you wish to run. Very easy to use. Then you just need to run sub process dot run and pass this entire Python list. This might take some time, not much. I think about uh, 10 to 20 seconds for small audios and for large audios also not much. One to two minutes. Once done, there is a particular folder test where this particular audio will go in for CLI out. This will be your actual output file that you would get from the audio cloner. And then you load that audio and you get all these MP3s. Now such MP3s can be a great resource if you wish to generate automated YouTube videos or even Udemy courses and whatever you wish to do. I hope this tutorial was useful and you try cloning your audios out. Thank you so much.